The top two I use are Claude and ChatGPT. Claude is my go-to writing assistant. Although ChatGPT has definitely gotten better at creative writing, but I don't think it's as good as Claude yet. And there's other writing tools like Jasper, Lex, WriteSonic, Copy, and tons of others. If there's a specific type of writing you do a lot, you may want to find one that's tailored for that. They typically all use Claude or ChatGPT under the hood, but they just have solid prompt engineering and a nice UI on top of it. For me, I just do my own prompting and have never felt the need for a specialized writing tool. Typically, I just get outlines and do the bulk of the actual tone and writing myself anyways. With ChatGPT, using custom GPTs or projects to streamline a repetitive task is something just about everyone will be able to do. The projects allow you to keep chats organized and contextually connected. It's great for long-term multi-step workflows. Here's a pretty easy one that I use for shorts. So I have a big list of types of hooks and example hooks that I uploaded to the project files. Then I have step-by-step -step instructions as well. To start, all I have to do is input my topic and it will give me a list of hooks in each style. So I can refine and pick one from there. Then it will move on to the next step of the workflow. So it's a whole collaborative process that speeds up short form creation a lot. I do also have this set up in Claude. This isn't particularly creative writing, so both work really well. Custom GPTs are great for very specific fixed behaviors, and they also have the benefit of exploring GPTs others have made public. If you have something you're thinking of creating, see if someone else already has. There's tons of options in here. One example I use that I really like is I have GPTs for crafting prompts. That's a huge time saver. This one's for videos. I just enter a simple prompt and it will elaborate into a much longer prompt that works better for AI video tools. And it gives multiple options. That's really nice to have. I have another one for LLMs, basically training ChatGPT to prompt itself, and another for text to image prompts. And an often overlooked feature is you can summon your GPTs in any chat. Just click the at sign and choose your GPT from the list, then ask for what you need. Then it will use all the context and instructions you've built into that GPT to tailor a response. But this is a coloring book page generator I made for my four-year-old. And I'll send that, and even though this is in an existing chat, without any additional context, it knows what to do and generates me a coloring book page. Again, I do recommend you actually create a list of your most time consuming tasks and try to find ways AI can help. Hopefully this video will give you some ideas and this huge list of tools will be a good place to start.